what's up guys anyway so this week I have been thinking a lot about stuff and well I redid my room moved some furniture around turned my bed moved my dresser very exciting time for me you know growing up or something like that I don't know but anyway going through all of my stuff made me realize I have so much stuff and I know it's not just me, like, we all have so much stuff, and, like, it's to the point where I'm just, I sit back, and I'm like, why? Why do I have so much stuff? Like, the fact that I have things that don't have a home, because, or a place that they go, because there's no place for them to go, that just, why do I have so much stuff? I don't get it, and, I guess... I'm the kind of person who, like, I, like, find, like, meaning in, like, the most pointless things. So, and, like, no matter how stupid it may seem, I may see it and just think, oh, well, this is from that one time where I did that one thing with those people and I had a lot of fun, or, like, I'm sorry. This card, it's about a show that I went to, a play, for my friend's neighbor, and we went to go see it, and I kept the card, because... I don't know, it's Narnia. I guess I like Narnia, so of course I'd keep the card, because I need it, right? Or this hat that I got at Portillo's when I went there with math team. I never wear this. I don't need this. It was honestly just a normal math meet. It, the most exciting thing about it was that we got ice cream. Like, but I keep it. Why do I keep it? And this, this is from a dance competition. I'm not a dancer. I worked it. I worked it for tech, which means I sat in a chair and told people where the bathroom was for a couple of hours. And someone left this, so I took it. And it's not even, like, the best one. It's high gold. It's not even platinum. Like, no one cares about this ribbon. That's why it was left behind. Why do I have it? Like, it's just... Yes, maybe it was fun to work the competition, but do I need it? Like, no. I Obviously, I don't need it. I don't need a lot of things that I have. Not that I don't appreciate them. I have stuff that I do appreciate. Like, I have, like, my ukulele, which I love because I got it for my birthday, and I love to play it. But at the same time, I'm also the kind of person who... If it doesn't matter to me, I really don't care. Like, I can look past things. While they might be important to me for a moment, if it breaks, I don't... It's not the end of the world. Like, I had a little blue thing. It was a little twisty toy. And I would always bring it around with me and let people play with it. And, like, I loved being able to do that for people because it, like, calmed them down and it, like... Gave them something that made them smile. And then it broke because it was old. It, it had been used a lot. And when it broke, I just... The girl who... It wasn't me who broke it. It was someone else. And she just looked so upset and, like, sorry. And I just said, it's okay. It's just a toy. Because that's all it is. Because it doesn't matter. Because ultimately, well, yes, I love my pictures and paintings and snow globes and bandanas and everything. It's just stuff. It doesn't matter. And I think it's strange how I always find myself at that like crossroads because yes, I find the most stupid things important and I find meaning behind literally everything. It doesn't matter if it's Like, it doesn't matter if it's grape juice or if it's a little ducks made out of pixel dots. What do you guys think, what makes stuff have value besides money or dollar amounts behind it? Like, what makes it important to you? Please tell me in the comment section below. And also, like this video if you enjoyed it. And subscribe to my channel if you would like to hear more of me rambling to a camera. So yeah. Anyways, have fun. Don't get lost and bring me back an adventure.
Bye, guys.